This game we're going to look at today is called What Never Was. Never heard of this game. Um, all I know about it is a granddaughter is to clear out a grandfather's attic after his passing and it unveils a lot about his history. Um, rather than talking, let's just dive straight in. Hey mom, where are you? Wait, what? So you're not coming? But I'm already here. I know, but mom, don't we owe it to grandpa to... Yeah, I know, it's just... What? You can't sell the clock? Grandpa's had that for years. Okay, okay, whatever, it's fine. I can just start clearing out my boxes and then, I don't know, we can come back tomorrow and do the rest? Yeah, bye. Well, that's a sad way to start off a conversation, isn't it? Okay. I'm really going to miss you, Grandpa. All right. Let's do this. Don't know what that was she was holding, but... Well, I'm sure we will see. But it looks like uh, to move around is WASD. I have always loved the British countryside. Nothing wrong with the British countryside, I'm going to say. So this is the attic we need to clear out. Play me. A tape recorder. The post-it says play me. That's definitely Grandpa's handwriting. A tape recorder. Nice to interrupt his right. Hello. This is Howard James Wright with a message for my granddaughter, Sarah Elizabeth Wright. So if anyone else is listening, they can start off immediately, please. <laughs> <clears throat> Sarah, if you are listening to this, then it means, well, it means I'm gone. But I don't want you to be too sad about it. That's just the way life goes sometimes. So, chin up, my little pixie. Remember our grand moments. All the adventures we had when you were a little one and I wasn't such a cranky old man. I, I know you have questions for me. It's true I kept secrets from you and your mother, but there were good reasons. There are things in this world greater than ourselves and I needed to protect you from them. I didn't want either of you to face the dangers that I've had to... <sighs> I never wanted to place such a burden on your shoulders, but now it... it's unavoidable. Pixie, I need your help. But I can't just tell you. I have to show you. You will need to see for yourself. This world is full of secrets. From the tallest tree to the deepest river, in every breath of wind and every dancing flame, all you have to do is look. Goodbye, Sarah. I love you very much. Oh. Goodbye, Grandpa. So we've got a necklace, a student ID, and a cell phone. Okay, so it was the necklace she had in her hand. So I suppose we should look around and see if there's anything. Hey, Mr. Piggles. How have you been holding up? Hey, Mr. Piggles. How have you been <laughs> holding up? Don't you oink at me. <laughs> hey, Mr. Piggles. I like the pig. I like the pig, I must say. Does this globe have anything to do with Grandpa's message? Maybe. Who knows? What did the message say again? The world is full of secrets? The world is most definitely full of secrets. Let's see what else is in the attic, shall we? It's going to take forever to sort through all these. 
Grandpa sure did like his books. Nah, I don't feel like reading up on kings, countries, or... The Hero with a Thousand Faces by Joseph Campbell. Fairies by Brian Froud and Alan Lee. It's about a lot of books there, I'm not gonna lie. It's a banker's lamp. A desk drawer. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Dang, they're all locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Yeah, they're all locked. That's fine. I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. Uh, okay, so we need to find missing pages. It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying things. Okay. I'm only here to pick up my stuff, but maybe I'll grab this later. These books are all so old. Hey, wait. Is that the biography of George Lucas? Oh, a man with style. A man with style, <sighs> I It's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa sure did like his books. Celtic myths and legends. These books are all so old. Hey, wait. Oh, Grandma's cello. So this is where it ended up. I really wish I knew if that was in tune or not. I'm gonna say no, it wasn't in tune, but I mean... Good Fairies effort. by Brian Froud and Alan Lee. So when you look at something and you feel like there should be something under it, I think that's where she picked up a necklace from before. I'm trying to find this missing page of that book. Maps. Lots of maps. I'm sure some of these are worth keeping, but I'm not going to sit down and sort through them right now. I'm sure some of these are worth keeping, but I'm not going to sit down and sort through them right now. Oh, the missing page. Okay. Oh, back in the 80s, you can kind of feel this music. It's very um, post-war type gala, like ball type music. Ah, uh, the old gramophone. Yeah, enough of that. Yeah, enough of that. I should see if I can- Oh! Grandpa's old travel diary. Seems like a few pages are missing. I, know, put, I should see if I can find the, the missing pages before moving this. We have more than one missing page, do we? Oh, okay, do. There's a lot of them. Um... Celtic myths and legends. <sighs> it's going to take forever to sort through all these. Grandpa sure did like his books. They really did, I'm not gonna lie. Nothing on the rug. Let's find some missing pages. We found one already. Really did like his books, didn't he? My grandfather's grandfather clock. How much okay. wood would a woodchuck chuck give him? It's locked. Grandpa loved this thing. Told me it was one of a kind. Although, he never actually told me why. I'm sure we'll find out why it's one of a kind. A typewriter. I like the interaction the element, but this is a very good game. By Joseph Kemp. There's no one to play. And I'm not sure I even know the proper rules. No, I neither do I. It's chess, to be fair. I came by train. I'm leaving by train. It's an old table lamp. Just the two pages what's missing, do you reckon, or...? Pele, goddess of fire. Why was Grandpa researching Hawaii myths? That's very true. I was saying I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. I think you I sure can. could draw, though. I mean, look at that goddess dragon thing. Diary pages? I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving oh, this. So we need three and four. Okay. Still, 
still missing some pages. Do I not have a key? I don't, do I? Do have the key to be fair. It does look beautiful outside. Such an old attic. Reminds me so much of like the kind of attics you would see in your grandparents' old house. Oh man, my old A station. I spent hours playing games on this thing. Damn, the adapter's missing. Probably for the best. I wouldn't yeah. get anything done today if I started playing. That's true, we never get anything done if we start a game and I tell you that right now. Take it from someone who knows. So I am missing two more journal pieces and I don't know where they are. Fairies by Brian Froud and Alan Lee. There is no way I can pick this up. I am not taking this with me right now. Can we not move it? It's a landscape painting of Whittington. I am not taking this with me right now. So this is Sarah's thing. I'm not grabbing my stuff until I've made sure I have everything I need in here. Okay, dokie, that's fine. So we still have... We still have two more pieces of paper to find. Anyone... I'm sure they've got to be around here somewhere. These books are all so old. Hey, wait. Is that the biography of George Lucas? Oh, well, there's a draw. I didn't see that one. An open desk drawer. Alright, these are still locked, locked aren't they? Oh, okay. So we need some sort of key, but I don't know where I can find the key. It's a magnifying glass. For magnifying things. I feel like I'm missing something somewhere. It's such a cute game so far, but I'm most certainly missing something somewhere. Say the world is full of secrets, didn't he? Oh. Oh. Okay. These can be pushed. That doesn't seem to be it. What did the message say again? Ah, shoot. From the tallest tree to the deepest river. That's not it. Paria, Pariacaca, South America. And that looks like a drop of water. Shu, Egypt. And a symbol of a swirl? Fusang, China. And a symbol of a tree. That's from the tree. In every breath of wind and every dancing flame. Could he be referring to these symbols? Water swirl. <laughs> we did it. We figured it out. We figured it out. This looks like is this a second part of my necklace? I found another piece of the necklace and when I look through it stuff glows and I see things that aren't there. What the hell is going on? Right, so V. 
Woe. Serious woe. Oh. It needs a key to open. Alright, so... The key I have doesn't fit here. So this might be the key to the drawers. I wonder if the paper's in here. Okay. Nah. I can find my way back to the train station without it. I should see if I can find the missing pages before moving this. Right, okay, so I've got the photograph in the I gym. should see if I can. Oh! Grandpa's old travel diary. Oh. Hmm. Seems like a few pages are missing. Let's have a look through this, see if I can see anything. This might give me the code. Okay. So will something highlight on each one? It does. Pixie, because that's what he called her. That's her name. Okay, and that'll be some. So what can I see on here? Oh god, right, okay. It won't budge. I probably need to select the clock hand somehow. It won't budge. Weren't these triangles in the journal pages? Aren't these triangles what? This clock hand is a triangle facing outwards, with a line going through it. Okay. I probably need to select the clock hand somehow. It won't budge. So this needs to be a triangle, wow. Uh... I don't know what the little hand is. It's stuck in it's it won't budge. It's stuck in place. It's stuck in place. This hand is a triangle facing outwards. Alright, okay. It weighs like two hundred pounds. Hmm. Alright, let's go and have a look at that box through the necklace and see if we can figure it out. Anything in this book? Anyway, is there anything anywhere? So this ornamental key. small key that was a desk, it looks set out. The tallest trees are deepest river and every breath of wind and every dancing flame. All you have to do is look. Okay. Journal page one. The triangle is on the fire. Fire, water, 
the train went. Let's have a look at this grandfather clock again, because it's obviously something to do with this clock. in the journal pages? They won't budge. I probably need it stuck in place. How can I select these triangles somehow? Anything else around that I am missing? Okay, so you've got fire, wind, tree and water. Fire. Only one hand can go. Fire and tree. He won't budge. He won't budge. There's got to be something that shows you something around here. So there's nothing on that, these journal pages. I need to set these hands correctly. Maybe the answer is around the journal pages. One hand, that's the issue. So what is that? That is the one pointing in. Not that one. It's the one pointing in with a line through it, so that needs to go to the tree. Where's the tree? Directly down. I probably need to select a clock hand somehow. There is no way I can pick this up. How do I select the clock hand somehow? This hand is a triangle facing outwards. This clock hand is a. This clock hand is a triangle face. Aren't these triangles in the journal page? This clock hand. They are. Is a but I don't know how to select the other ones. With a line through it. They are, but I don't know how to select the other ones. How strange. Right, so you've got that one, which is on there, which is good. You need to move the other ones, but how do you move the other ones? That is the question. This button seems to control the <gasps> clock hand can be moved. Okay, we got it. It's a triangle. Oh, not that one. Triangle. Triangle is flame. Flame okay. is 11. So okay. I need to set these hands correctly. Maybe the answer is in Grandpa's journal pages. Did not see that triangle up there before. I wish I'd seen that before. No. So downward triangle, I think that's that one, which is water, yes. So that's water is water, water, water is there. He won't budge. It's this one, that's the one. And then you want that one, which is that one, and that is going to, which is that one, is that that one? Wind, whichever one's left, so it's number two. Was that it? Did I do it? Oh, we did it, finally. What is this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. what's happening? Oh, 
Oh, wow. That was the first time I traveled by magic, pulling at the thread that would unravel my grandfather's mysteries. I so wish he told me sooner, so we could have gone on at least one adventure together. Instead, I went on his adventure, the one that never was. Mm. But that is a longer story for another time. That's actually quite sad. What a beautiful, beautiful game. Albeit a very short game, what an absolutely beautiful game. Highly recommended. Um, I would definitely, definitely um, check this game out. If you've got 10 or 15 minutes of your free time, definitely give it a go. Um, you actually get quite invested in it, considering it's such a short game. But definitely worth, worth the time. Um, all the descriptions and uh, links for the game will be in the uh, section below. Um, don't forget guys for more indie updates, um, indie games and upcoming trailers for new games on all platforms. Don't forget to subscribe for free and while you're there hit a like on the video as well. Thank you very much and I will see you next time. Bye for now!